Whoa. Today is Thursday. Actually, we are expecting cold rain the next couple of days. <laughs> so, today, this road right here is like a quick opportunity. I'm about to bring out the rain coat. You name it tomorrow. <laughs> but I'll see you. I might just. It depends on how cold the rain is. That's how I. I am going to base my coming out on <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> yes, that's what it is going to be. So, <laughs> ah, it is Thursday. I don't really have a lot on my mind this morning. <clears throat> It's almost like I'm in that form of a prayer mood, you know, just uh, wishing well. That's it. Nothing more than that, really. Just wishing well. So, yes, uh, the cold weather in the rain the next couple of days. <laughs> Got to use some skills. So, I might just see what happens tomorrow. I might not run tomorrow, but it just depends. But, uh, the next couple of days it's gonna be cold, rainy, snow, it's out, yes. But it will be a lot easier, but um <clears throat> man, that's why I need that raining gear. I need a sponsorship. Somebody needs a sponsor me. <laughs> that way I have all those gears and I can just come out anytime I wanted. <laughs> I've actually been shot in my mouth lately, so what I've actually been doing. I wanted to do 26, so I was, I've been stuck in around 20 to 21, you know, that's just the wind thing right there. <laughs> so that's what I've done this year. Believe it or not, I think I've probably run up to 700 miles this year already. <laughs> I'm always at a thousand. <laughs> you know, for the year. So yes. Uh, so I'm just sort of in that mood today where it's actually going to be the new moon today. So look at that moon. Is that the moon or the sun? I don't know which one it is. So it's going to be the new moon today around, depends on what area. I think around here is going to be around, yeah, about that one something. It's the new moon. The time to just regroup. I call it so uh, just like today this morning uh, all I'm feeling is just in that prayer mood just a form of thank you and just uh, uh, that's just it so but in it I like I said <laughs> I've done a lot of yoga the last couple of years. <laughs> I can't even remember how many hours I've done, but uh, <laughs> four, four hours a day is, is very unique. So with the two hour meditation, because I was just, and, it, and that's just it right there because uh, our body can heal itself, itself, shall I say, but it takes extremely hard work. I like the way it's done in the movies. In a couple of days, the guy will get her and we just know. But it takes extremely hard work. It's almost like you have to let go of everything. And you're almost like 24 7. You have to push your body until it gets tired. You sleep, then you wake up and do it again. So it just requires a lot of discipline. And that's the route that I've been. Over the last couple of years now and like i always say you develop a sense of faith beyond your own imagination where you are always just chanting praying and all that and you should begin to look at this energy as how okay i can speak to this energy there's a language that this energy that makes us breathe this life understood and you begin to want to just speak to it more. It's absolutely crazy because um, you kind of understand where religious 
different religions are actually coming from. Like our mind is, is connected to that higher self or God, whatever you want to call it. And you could really speak to it. But one has to really mean it from the bottom of the heart. So today, that's all I'm feeling. Just feeling that feeling of prayer and manifesting and just wishing well. And in that center stage. Because I said, you know, I want to sit in the lotus pose again. And I kid you not, trying to open that lower back. Absolutely amazing. But what it is, when yoga becomes every day for you, you begin to know where your spine is in your lower back. A lot of us, our spine is locked up, so we don't really know the movement. We don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah. And that's why, because that lockness, that's why a lot of us have that mucus in our nose. <laughs> we don't even realize it, because when that thing is locked up like that due to stress, and it just makes you realize how unique this body of ours is. Absolutely amazing when you study it. That's why I admire the doctors because whew, it takes a lot of studying and in order for them to get things done properly, we have to study our own body, which makes it a lot easier. And I guess that's the same thing that we do with our religious background. We just expect another person to have the whole answer to our problems on like us actually knowing that the same power, the same energy, <laughs> we have it. So let me just continue this easy jog this morning. I like to slow down so that I can see what I'm doing. So, and that's just what I'm just thinking of this morning. That, that's just all the emotion that's going coming through me from my feet everywhere. So, uh, yes. I'm just gonna do a quick 20 today and then uh, today's what Friday Thursday no it's Thursday <laughs> so I'm gonna say happy Thursday <laughs>